Hey guys, and welcome back to the second video on getting down and dirty with the Denon HD 2500. I'm Lance from Big Show Mobile Entertainment, and today we're going to show you how to connect it to the computer to USB enable the device so you can transfer files and put them on the internal hard drive. With the unit off and a USB cable connected from the PC to 2500. You need a B type N for the 2500 to connect to the PC. We'll plug that in, power up the unit. Of course, we'll recognize the welcome screen here. Okay, once the unit's powered up and ready to go, you'll notice that nothing has happened yet with the computer. The computer has not recognized the device and we want to basically get it to recognize it as an external hard drive. So we can select our source. This will change up here for the source. Turn the wheel until the outside around PC is flashing and then select. We've just USB enabled this device. Now the computer is going to find it. You may get some messages, new hardware found, device driver install, and all that fun stuff. Go with it just like with any other external hard drive you hook up the first time. Now this one has been hooked up to this computer many times, so it recognizes it right away. and just treats it like an external hard drive. If we go to the computer screen here, shows the internal hard drive and then a local disk. Basically from this point if you want to, there's a couple different ways. You can read the book or you can go with the down and dirty method which is to copy and paste the music you want to that drive and then use the Denon Music Manager to create your database. So that's how you hook it up. In order to turn it off, first thing we do is safely remove the device Once that's gone, we unplug the USB cable and turn off the 2500. That's how you exit from device mode. Stay tuned. The next video, we're going to get into creating the database with the Denon Music Manager software. Till then, practice and enjoy.